Hello again everyone, Edwin Lerner back once again. In this YouTube astrological segment, I'm going to be dissertating and talking about the ruler of the 12th house posited in the 6th house in a natal horoscope. Well, as most of you know, the 12th house is connected with restrictions, limitations, self-undoing, in enemies or adversaries, um, things done privately, secretively, hospitals, prisons, the metaphysical. We look at the 6th house. It's connected with work, employment, diet, exercise, fitness, um, animals, which are often uh, persons, pets, and uh, just basically service performed uh, for others. Well, anyway, let me get started. The first thing is that perhaps this person experiences some kind of limitations uh, and or restrictions that are connected with health, health their employment, the service performed uh, for others, uh, their diet perhaps, uh, perhaps something connected with exercise. Maybe this person has some debilitation that prevents them from working out or, or doing the things that they really would like to do as far as being fit, self undoing may come, uh, may be connected with the health. Uh, maybe this person puts too much emphasis, for example, on health matters and maybe becomes obsessed uh, to some degree. That's like an example. This person might be very private uh, as far as their, um, I guess you could say, private, secretive, regarding maybe their place of employment, what they do for a living, uh, matters that are concerning, uh, pertaining to their health, their employment. Uh, maybe this in some isolated cases, maybe this person experiences a loss of a pet, an uh, abrupt loss sooner than anticipated. Uh, we we'll look at this placement and 12th house could be connected with the metaphysical, so it, this could be something where maybe the metaphysical part of this person, the paranormal, is injected into the work life somehow. Even if this person doesn't do this for a living, maybe this um, part of the person um, is somehow comes out or expressed at work. Maybe this person talks about these matters. Uh, frequently with uh, co-workers, fellow employees, for example. Uh, look at this placement, and the 12th house is also connected with hospitals, prisons. Uh, perhaps this person, um, I guess maybe their some experience with hospitals and or prisons might affect their work life. Maybe someone that they know at a hospital gets them uh, at a job working. Um, working at one. Um, their compassionate uh, quality, uh, philanthropic quality may come out through their work um, and employment. Um, there might be some restrictions, limitations affecting uh, this person's um, this person's health uh, to some degree. Uh, perhaps their ability to get um, a, uh, to work on some capacity look at this placement too in the 12th house since it corresponds with Pisces. There might be some ambiguity, ambivalence, confusion, chaos that impacts this person's work life. It could be something very well more likely out of, out of work. There might be some confusion that just um, plays a role at their, at their job and maybe causes a distraction uh, perhaps to some degree. Maybe this person just uh, experienced confusion just kind of somehow come out comes out through uh, through their work life to some degree maybe there's other people at work their fellow employees co-workers might pick uh, this up uh, to some degree there might be some mystery confusion that's connected with this person's health um, they might have some enigmatic uh, health matter or concern that might be somewhat um, I guess you could say might be somewhat enigmatic, might be something that they haven't really quite figured out, um, perhaps, or maybe this person experiences some sickness or debilitation at times and they don't really know what the reason is um, as, as a possibility. 
Uh, we'll look at this placement too, and we look at the twelfth house is connected with hidden enemies or adversaries, and we'll look at this and perhaps, um, perhaps maybe a hidden enemy could be to this person's detriment in terms of their work life, their employment to some degree. Maybe they succumb to some scandal in some isolated cases, if uh, or something negative that this person says about. Uh, him or her uh, to some, in maybe uh, to the person's employer or someone at the company, which causes uh, problems for this person. Uh, for example, uh, maybe the hidden enemy become, maybe do something to somehow uh, conflict with this person's, um, I guess you could say this person's work life uh, to some degree. Uh, such as um, an anonymous call made to um, to an employer saying something derogatory, bad, or something that may not be true, to try to impact this person's work life, uh, I guess to their to their detriment. As as an example, so anyway, people that will conclude this YouTube astrological segment for the ruler of the twelfth house, positive in the sixth house, in a natal horoscope. Stay tuned next time, where I'll be dissertating and talking about the ruler of the 12th house and the 7th house in the natal chart. Two things I want to get with you on before I head out. Firstly, the stars may impel, but do not compel. And secondly, never isolate any single astrological element, aspect, planetary placement, position, configuration, influence, or what have you, and make an analysis on a person, astrologically speaking, based on this alone, because a person astrologically the sum of all their components in their natal chart, and not just one. Until next time, people, stay well.